Hi and welcome back to Quinwell Paw Creations tutorial videos. Today I'm going to show how I created a mirror image design to put on a pair of custom order moccasins that I made for a customer. She asked for the Northern Lights. I purchased a Stitches Lover Shop Northern Lights cross stitch pattern and I did it in size 11 seed beads onto some brain tan leather for the tops. I printed the design right onto the print and stitch stabilizer. Fits goes right through my printer. I have my image downloaded onto my Word document and we're going to I'm going to show how I went in and created that mirror image flipped it over so what we're going to do is we're going to um, I'm going to right click this I'm going to copy it and I'm going to paste it right onto the same page paste it and then that gives us two images of this they're the same so we're going to keep the top image highlighted because that's the one we're going to flip. We're going to go into the format tab and we're going to look for the rotate tab drop down menu and we're going to flip this horizontally and it just flips over and it makes it a mirror image of that design. I just drag that down and position it onto the paper below the design above and we're going to go over and we're going to print that both images will come up onto the same page and you have your mirror image designs so any design that you put in there you can flip it you can insert that picture and when I started beading I <clears throat> We started section by section, did a foundation piece across the bottom, and then did the areas I wanted to emphasize. Started section by section the colors and where I wanted them to be placed with the Northern Lights shading to get it to go across the toe in a, in a good baited northern light shading and then once I had that whole one completed then I have to match the other side and try to get them as close as possible with that each with where those sections are located onto the first side and the lines and the northern lights and the land pieces that I have in there and get it to go over to the mirror image. I'm not real good at it and I've had a I have a lot of trouble with it before. But now I have my cell phone so I'm able to take pictures section by section. So I started with my foundation piece across the bottom and tried to get that as mirrored as possible with the design to be on the flip side flip side. Um, on each side on each piece and then once I have that foundation done then I took the two sides and I matched them up which is a, which is why it's really good to do your outline edge and your across the arch pattern before you do the inside so I just matched up because the pattern is not perfect. But I kind of put it where I wanted to emphasize that light green is the color that I was looking for to start with and highlight so that the others would just coincide with that because that's what I started with. Matching up side to side and getting that land piece where I needed it to be so that that is where 
another foundation of another section would be and really basically doing that section by section and I started the same way I started the other side working those colors and lines and sections in the same way I did the first one and following the photos I took on my phone made it much easier than in the past when I would struggle with it but once you got it going you could see where they would actually go into place and it didn't come out perfect but it turned out very well the customer was very happy with the outcome of the moccasin looks real good can't real tell it's not perfect but it it is a mirror image and it unless you're real close and really examining you probably aren't going to be able to really tell so there is my uh, mirror image pattern for a pair of moccasins thanks for stopping by um, it was nice to see you again or hear from me again um, stop by and join our group on facebook um, beating circle please answer all three questions or i won't add you in or you can stop by my website www.quinwellpawcreations.com where i have all my kits available that i have for sale so thanks for stopping by see you next time